Hello and welcome back to a very special hated video. In this video, we're going to be playing the latest Spring or the March 2024 update, which is highly anticipated. And I just entered in my game. You can see the pop-up update needed. Update now to the new version and get free diamonds. I'm really excited. I know a lot of people were waiting for this video, so this is going to be a little gameplay, kind of a show off of the new update. So I'm just going to update it and then we'll see what's new. So before I start playing it, let's see what's new. Time for a tune-up. It's springtime and hate it. The Essential Oils Lab Protection Building is available to unlock today, along with two Essential Oil Recipes. A sanctuary ostriches land today and a new pet bird will join in April. Mm, I wonder what that's going to be. We've refreshed uh, the voucher and decoration shops to improve your experience. And of course, we have more events, decorations, plus lots more to come. Stay tuned for next month's daily news to know what's all coming. Okay, now let's get right into the game. I'm so excited. Okay, so here we go. Are you guys excited? Because I'm really excited. It's always that exciting moment when you've updated your game and you're just waiting for it to load. So here we go. And so I just got my 10 diamonds for updating to the latest version. I'm so glad they've increased the amount because usually um, they only used to bring like five diamonds, but I'm so happy. Okay, so you guys already know what's been added in this update. This was a very small update, which was kind of a shock to me because usually the spring updates are the biggest. You know, those are like the first updates of the year. Now, I don't know why they did it this time. They also did not share the information with us. And this update was like a complete surprise, which I did not like. And I'm not hating. Please don't get me wrong. It's just my opinion. I would appreciate if they could actually, you know, share information and don't do the surprises. I love sneak peeks. I love to get them. That actually builds up the whole excitement and whole enthusiasm. So yeah, the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm actually going to have like a general overview of the farm to see if there's anything new, any clues for the next update, any glitches in the system. <laughs> you know, something unusual might be here because usually there are some things that are not very common. So the farm pretty much looks the same. I don't think there's anything new. I'm just going to open the mystery box, got some diamonds, what's going on in my neighborhood. Okay, somebody requested the pickaxes. We're going to donate them. Let's see what is going on over here. Okay, I have a super booster, which is good. And I'm just going to check the inbox to see what is here. It's all about the events. All right, the first thing that I'm going to do before I actually start showing you guys the new items, we're going to do a little tour of Greg's farm because Greg has everything you need to see. So let's see what does Greg have for us today. Alrighty, his farm has been updated for the Easter, which is brilliant. Look at all these new decorations. You guys, I am so shocked. Okay, this one, uh, I think this was from last year, if I'm not wrong. But you can see these decorations that we will get from the uh, actual Easter egg maker event. And probably there's also going to be like a diamond pack, I'm pretty sure, for the Easter. I am so excited because this farm looks wonderful. Um, I love the new aesthetic of the decorations. They're very colorful and very vibrant. Now, does he have the new decoration? I wonder. Now, does he have now does he have the new machine? I wonder. That is my question. Wait, what is this? <gasps> Look at these new musical fences. Oh my god. This is so incredible. Where where can I get them from? Please, I need them and hopefully it's not a diamond pack. I mean, I don't know. They're like a vetting theme, right? So maybe they're coming soon. Who knows? Uh, okay, what else do we have? The other Easter decorations. Let's check the town. Any clues in the town? Hopefully there will be. Ah, uh, the carrot fences. God, that's a lot of decos. Honestly, I never get tired of these new decorations. And they always keep bringing more and more. So you guys know that we got the ostriches, and I'm just going to see if they're here uh, in the Greg's Sanctuary, hopefully there will be. I mean, I'm not sure. Usually it takes a little bit of time to put the new animals in the Sanctuary, but if they're not, then I can show you guys a little bit of animation later. Uh, okay, just gonna do a little quick search. Uh, my eyes usually get blind at this time when I'm trying to find the new animal, I just can't find it. So I don't think that there's like any uh, new animal here. I don't find the ostriches. Or maybe they're here, but I can't see them. Well, I'm not even going to take any risks. Okay, so let's start talking about the new stuff. The first thing 
As I mentioned again, it's not a very big update, which is not so exciting, but still, we got the new stuff. First thing, the vouchers have been replaced. Now you can find them within the game shop. You just have to tap on the very bottom left corner of the game. And at the very top, this golden color, it says your vouchers and everything just shows here. From a UI's point of view, this seems okay. But to be fair and to be honest, I preferred the old look. This looks kind of modern. This, this looks close to the whole graphics of the game. You know, the new UI that we got last year. Um, so yeah, I mean, I'll obviously get used to it. And they said that they've improved like the decorations tab. So I'm gonna see if there's anything new over here. Um, I don't see anything new. It's pretty much the same. It tells the name of the decoration, of course, its size. Right, now it's time to talk about the new machine. That is Essential Oils Lab. All right, so this all looks at level 68. And the cost is 85,000 coins. Um, this isn't expensive at all, as a lot of people were getting scared that, you know, it's going to rip them off. No, don't worry. It's just 85,000 coins, which I'm pretty sure is not even that expensive. Um... It's a low-level machine, which to me doesn't make sense because I feel like we already have a lot that's going on at the lower levels. Um, and it would have been much better if they brought it, you know, at a higher stage. But I think if they're trying to balance the game somehow, this makes sense. So we're just going to purchase it. It looks so gorgeous. You guys can see. Um, it's very beautiful. I mean, it's very different from other machines. And if you have a close look, the main infrastructure of this building resembles to the mint oil bottle. All right, here we go. Um, now it's gonna take three days and seven hours or I could spend 89 diamonds, which I'm not gonna do. I'm a very patient person when it comes to, you know, waiting for the new machines. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna wait on that. But we got two new products that I guess I can show you guys right now um, that are gonna be over here. Yeah, we got the Mint Essential Oil 15 Minutes and the lemon essential oil. I'll be talking about them in more detail once I unwrap this machine. Okay, so that's about the new machine and the two new products. Secondly, we've got the ostriches, uh, the new sanctuary animals. To be fair, I'm a little disappointed with it because, you know, I it's gonna take ages for me to unlock them. You can see them over here. I need 36 pillow pieces. It's insane. I still have a lot of animals to unlock, so I think it's gonna be till 2034 that I get all these animals. And is that a mistake that I see? Look at the spelling of the gray ostrich. Unless I'm living in a wrong world, I don't think that's how you spell the word gray, but it doesn't even matter. What am I talking about? Um, and of course you get the new decos with them. Uh, let me see if I can show you guys their habitat over here. Um, yeah, this is how it's gonna look like. It's called as the ostrich nest. If you wanna look at the decos, you can watch my previous um, sneak peek videos for uh, the update. Right, so I think that's it. Uh, basically, two sanctuary animals and a new machine. I mean, that's a very small update, considering it's a spring update, which are usually the biggest ones. But who am I to complain? Of course, we got the Easter egg maker in the game, and they said that there's going to be a new bird coming next month, and there's going to be a lot of other decorations. So that concludes the spring or the March 2024 update. Do I like it? Um, A little bit. You know, I just like the new machine. The animals are not going to do anything to me. The other aspects, I don't consider them in the update. For me, those are the naturally occurring part of the game. Even if you don't update it, they are always going to come. So for me, decos and events, they're not part of the update. It's not a new thing. So I'm not very happy about this update. I'm not complaining. I mean, maybe next update will be big, hopefully. Um, but I think, yeah, that's just it. And I don't see any other changes. Let me know if you guys saw other changes or other unusual things at your farm. So oh, I guess I'm just going to end the video here. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. What do you think of this update? And subscribe for more Haiti content that I'll be posting. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. Bye.